everyone. Today's topic is all about perimeter of triangles and quadrilateral. What is a perimeter? The perimeter of a polygon is equal to the sum of the length or the length of all its sides. Perimeter is the distance around a plane figure. First, we have the perimeter of a triangle. The perimeter of a triangle has a formula of P is equal to S sub 1 or side 1, S sub 2 plus S sub 3, where P stands as perimeter and S sub 1 as side 1, S sub 2 as side 2, and S sub 3 as side 3. Let's take for this example. We have this triangle. As you can see, the measurement of this side is 8 centimeters, and this side, the opposite side, is 10 centimeters, and the base side is 9 centimeters. So if we are going to get the perimeter of this triangle, we will use this formula. And for the solution, we have P is equal to S sub 1, S sub 2, plus S sub 3. So we let this 8 centimeter as S sub 1 or the side 1. And this 9 centimeter or the base side as S sub 2. And the 10 centimeter or this side is the S sub 3. So we have 8 centimeter plus 9 centimeter plus 10 centimeter and the total of it is equals to P is equals to 27 centimeters. And now let's go to the perimeter of quadrilateral. So we have an example of a quadrilateral which is a square. So we have the perimeter of a square. The perimeter of a square has a formula of P is equal to 4 times S. Where P stands as perimeter and S stands as the side. So as you can see, or if we are going to define what is a square, a square is a polygon or a quadrilateral having a 4 equal sides. So we have an example here. This is a square denoted with this single line. As you can see, all the sides of this given square has this denotation, a single line, which denotes that the side measurement of each side of this given square are all equal in measurement. So as you can see, it is 13 centimeters. So for the solution, we have P is equal to 4 times S. And the measurement of this S is 13 centimeters. So we have 4 times 13 cm, then it will give us 52 centimeters. Next, we have the perimeter of a rectangle or a parallelogram. So, as we define or the definition of rectangle, it is a parallelogram or a quadrilateral having two pairs of opposite sides. So the perimeter of a rectangle has a formula of P is equal to 2L plus 2W, where P stands as perimeter, L as length, and W as width. So as you can see for this example, 
we have here the two sets or two pairs of an opposite side. So we have this side is opposite onto this side. And they have their equal measurement. Same with this uh, side and this side. Denoted by, denoted by two single uh, two small lines and the two small lines, it means that these two sides are equal in measurement. So we left here as the length and this is the width. So for the solution, we have P is equal to 2L plus 2W. P is equal to 2, open parenthesis, 15 centimeter close parenthesis. It refers to 2 times 15 plus 2 times 11. Then it will give us P is equal to 30 cm plus 22 cm. Then it will give us the total of 52 centimeter. So the perimeter of this given triangle, uh, rectangle is 52 centimeter. And for your exercise, we have exercise A. Solve the following by showing your complete and step-by-step -step solution. So we have number 1, number 2, number 3, number 4, and a number 5, and number 4. And for your exercise B, we have solved the following or solved the problem by showing your step-by-step -step and complete solution. So the problem is a rectangle, I mean a rectangular residential lot has a length of 25 meters and a width of 17 meters. What is the perimeter of the lot? If the dimensions are increased by 6 meters, what is the difference in the perimeter of the two lots? So I think that's all for today. Have a great day and may God bless you.